Hello everyone, my name is Bianca Bombshell and thank you for tuning into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to create this fun and easy pin-up hairstyle with the use of hairspray, bobby pins, and a bandana. I started off just by pre-curling my hair with a medium-sized curling iron and spraying the ends a little bit. For this tutorial, I'm going to be wearing this extremely beautiful dress, the Sabrina, from Cherry Velvet Plus. Alrighty, let's begin. So now that you have pre-curled your hair a little bit, what you want to do is you want to grab a section of the front of your hair where the front roll will go. Depending on the thickness of your hair will depend on how much you grab. I like to go pretty big, so I'll grab a pretty good section of the front there, about yay. Then with this point, you just want to make the lines clean. You don't have to do this, I just like to do it. So starting at that tip there, just come forward towards your face, creating a straight line like this. Just so it looks clean. So in case you see any of those parts, it's going to be super clean. Now keep in mind I am using the webcam as a mirror, so nothing is perfect. When I do photo shoots, I will use a mirror. I will be much more precise and make sure that nothing shows. So with this section, just brush it up. And then you're going to want to curl it under, so I like to use my thumb, I just wrap it around my thumb. Then I roll that. I get my little thumb under there and then I have a little roll. So then I continue to bring this roll down towards my head. And then once I get to here, it looks like this. So I take it and I turn it to the side because I'm gonna pin this and then I'm gonna work on the rest of my hair. And I'm just going to spray it lightly so by the time I come back it will have held the curl a little bit. So I'll just put that right there. Okay, so now that your roll is in place, you just want to grab a little hairspray and just give it a quick little spray at the front just to hold the curl. I like to use Dove um, hairspray, but when I'm doing pinup shoots, I'll often use a much more heavy-duty hairspray. So the ends are curled a little bit. Um, you don't want them too curly at this point because you're just going to brush them out. So for this, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to the sides and just do a quick brush because you want those sides to be nice and flat. And this is a really simple, simple look. This is something I do when I'm going to work for the day and I just want to look, look fancy. Okie dokie. So. Pulling the hair back, just bringing it up to the top of your head here. Now if you want, you can use a hair tie and you can just make a little ponytail or you can just pin it like this, kind of like a little French, like a French twist. So then you have all this hair at the front. So I'll just kind of come in and I'll just gather it and kind of go over my French twist at the back, kind of like that. And I'll just fasten it with a few pins, just really quickly here, just in the bottom. Come around to this side. So that's just up, just being crazy on your head. You can just let that just look nutty. It's supposed to be just free and, you know, easy. I get a lot of compliments when I wear my hair like this, and it's it's super easy. This is one of the easiest styles that I do. It's so simple. So what I do is I'll, I'll take the bandana and I'll fold it in half like this, like a triangle. And then I'll fold both ends in. So it's a triangle, you want to fold this end towards that there. Basically all you're doing is you're just making a long strip of your bandana. So like that, it's pretty simple. Coming from behind, bring it up, go right behind your curl, 
as I said, this was extremely simple. Just a quick little tie there. A double tie behind my ears. I use bobby pins as fasteners to hold my bandana in place. Just like this. Okay, so now you want to reconstruct the front roll just to have it look pretty. Now there's a lot of things you can do with this roll at this point. If you wanted to, we could roll forward, under, I guess is what I mean, and then towards your face. So this little roll is up under, and what you can do with this is you can fan it out, and you can make little bow or faux Betty bangs. And with this, you just grab your pins, and you come up right at the edge, and you pin them under like this, and then you fan it out. This takes a lot of work to get it perfect. I don't wear this style too much. I'm not a big fan of the Betty bangs on my face, but I do wear them often, and I really like it. Just not for today. So this one is really simple. I'm going to do two little rolls. So I'm going to separate this. I'm going to bring this section down. Let's do this one first. So we're going to go up just like we styled initially. And we're going to curl it under your thumb, around your thumb, whatever. Under, now your thumb's out. You got the roll down towards your hand. I'm going to grab it around again. Now I have a little roll right there. So grab <clears throat> one of your bobby pins and come in from the side right about there. Put me in there. This may spring forward when I let go. It's behaving. Okay, so I'll just give it a little spray. And another really good trick, if your rolls do spring forward, spray it and then grab a uh, hair dryer and then just hold your hair dryer to the, to the curl and it will just set it. So now with this curl, I'm going to go the opposite way. I'm going to come up towards my face like this. Up in the opposite direction that I went the other one. So just very carefully up, up, up till you reach your head. And then once you're at the very top there, just grab one of your bobby pins. Find one that matches your hair color, of course. Come in underneath. So I'm just pinning right under there, trying to get that bottom section of the roll. So right there. Yes, you can just barely see the pin, but you really can't see the pin. So I'm just going to double tie this because I don't like it to look too long. I'm going to give it a little spray. Alrighty, 